But I got one more thing, one more 800 news that I'll get you two both out of here. Because Donovan Brazier came out and said something that I think you guys need to hear, bro. This dude, Brazier, told Track and Field News that he's really interested at the Olympics or just on the world level to be in the 4x4 or the mixed relay. He wants to focus on the 8 right now, but he would love and his aspiration this year is to be on the 4x4 or the mixed relay and do that double. And I just got to ask you, is that possible? Can we see? Can a Dauvin Brazier start running fast? He has a PR of 46 in the open. He ran a 45 split in high school. So the dude's fast. But can he get, is he like 4x4 four four fast? What are you thinking, Aaron? Is he 4x4 four four fast? I mean, we got a crazy 4x4. Four four. Like, like we just think about the list of people that we could put on there. We got a ton of people. So when you first asked me this question, I was like, bro, like, no, he can't be on there. But when I'm thinking about it now at the Olympics, whether it's the mixed relay or it's the actual team, hey, you know, it's all about the ratings. You know, it's all about creating America's star. And if this guy's out here winning gold medal in the eight, let's throw him on a relay. Let's throw him on a relay, too. Let's build up some hype and, and, and the character around him. So I can see them doing it just because, like, He's America's like sweetheart. He's at 800, 800 king. So you just throw him on there too because everybody wants to see it. So it, it, it's possible. Vaji you, coach. <laughs> uh, I think it is possible in the rounds. Uh, in the finals, no, we have too many heavy hitters in the, in the U.S. <clears throat> we've got our 400 hurdlers who are studs. You know, we've got our open 400 guys. Do I? Yeah, I mean, me personally, I think he's going to be <clears throat> run a fast 1500 and then he's going to change his mind. <laughs> no, he'll run a fast eight, obviously, but I think his, you know, 15 is get so much faster that they're going to be like, uh, you know, we'll put your name in there maybe, but we'll see. Do, does he have the uh, capability of being an alternate? Yes. Do I think he'll, he'll be doing it? No. I, I think he will. I'm, I'm going to go totally left. I think he will be on the 4x4 <laughs> team, mixed relay. Or he may be on the 4x4 team right with Michael Norman as well and Fred Curley. And this is why I think so. After reading this quote and thinking more about Donovan Brazier over the years, I don't think we have talked about more about how, like, this dude exudes – uber confidence like almost to the cocky at one point i remember him on a podcast and people were asking him he's all like yeah i know for a fact i would be a professional wide receiver right now like he knows his capability <laughs> he knows the athletic ability and i think this uber confidence is the reason why he runs 142 is the reason why we may be seeing him running 141 this year at olympic trials and i don't know he may end up running 43 high split as well so i don't know uh Donovan brazier i'm right behind you i think you're gonna be on the mixed relay team bruh and hey these guys doubted you but i was with you from the start man so i just want to let you know that right now to be honest <laughs> hey i'm ready to see them in that 15 though craig yeah. you know craig and all them they're talking all that smoke i'm ready to see donovan involved in that beef you know i agree i think that would be more entertaining for us at least to see him in a 1500 and go to battle that way than to be on a on a four by four and just kind of i wouldn't say easily win but you know, be in that mix. I think it'd be interesting for <laughs> for that 1500. That 15 time will definitely come. We may have to wait a little bit, but it's gonna come for sure.